Things out of four, things are going very well. What's the secret? Uh, hard work, simplicity, and I think the players buying into uh, the new regime very quickly. And the pleasing thing is the, they've had the, re, uh, the rewards for the, for the hard work uh, that they put in. You can see what the wins have meant. What, what's it meant to you to get three good wins under your belt so early in your tenure here? I think um, belief is massive. Uh, if, if you're a coach, manager, you need the, uh, the players to buy into yourself. Uh, and I think the um, the application that the players have shown, uh, because they were very fragile when they first walked into the football club, as you, as you can imagine, they were adrift at the bottom of the bottom of the, uh, the, the league table. Confidence was low. Uh, they needed direction. Uh, they needed leadership. And. Probably the best thing that we did was we simplified everything for them. Individually, they knew their roles and responsibilities when they got onto the field of play, but we gave them that freedom to express themselves. Well, it seems to be working when you look at the results. I mean, how would you sum up your first month in the job? I think the, um, the first thing you look at is uh, the acceptance um, that I've had for, uh, when walking into the football club. We made to feel very welcome, very friendly environment to, uh, to come to work in. But again, I know that uh, it's always easier when you're winning. Um, but again, but uh, I've been able to have a free reign, as in uh, putting down the foundations and the platform uh, that I want to work with, which is which is very important. And hopefully, that foundation and that platform gives us um, the, well, as it says it says on the tin, the, the platform uh, to move this football club forward. Um, tell me about tonight's game then. Burton Albion, third place in the table, not perhaps in the best of form. How are you approaching this one? Um, I think they're a team that um, we need to show them respect. Uh, but likewise, uh, they're not a team that I think uh, that we need to fear. Uh, exactly the same as every team in this division, we will respect them, show them the respect they deserve. But we won't come onto the field to play fearing anybody. We think we can cause them a lot of problems tonight, which is a, which is our game plan. Do you think you're getting the full flavour of Carlisle United now? Yeah, definitely. I think the, the important thing I needed to do before I made any uh, or made a, uh, a few acquisitions was to find out exactly what's in the changing room. And I think the pleasing thing is the players that, 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 are, that are there are showing why they're here uh, and. They're showing that you know, the position we were in beforehand was uh, was a wrong position. Um, sounds like they're enjoying it as well. I've been reading about games of bingo on the bus down to Plymouth, that sort of thing. Yeah, but well, you've got seven and a half hours, and they're, they're young lads that you need to entertain. There's only so, so many computer games that you can play, and um, it did it lighten the mood, made the journey go a little bit quicker. We left early in the morning, which I think was important to get down and get the journey uh, as best as we could. Get out uh, a little bit of sightseeing. Some went down to see the, the Plymouth O, which is uh, a spectacle in itself for some, uh, for some of them that, uh, that they might not have seen before. Well, Keith, thank you again very much for joining us. So close to kick off as well. Burton Albion tonight. Congratulations on your first month, and uh, let's hope the good work continues this evening. Thank you very much. Sure.